patterns in the RV1 starts with a A sus2 chord, second and third fingers. You slide up that third finger and only that third finger when you come back down onto the G. So you play that G twice, but the second time with the D, and you slide the G. Not sliding both, because it doesn't sound like that. It's just one string sliding up to the fifth fret, third finger, and then second finger on that C, second finger to first finger, open, third fret for G, and back to A sus2. B in there, so it's not it's not barred, it's not flat. Up one fret. So from the F, that four finger's tucked into the fourth fret there. Pull away to the third fret. Good to have the uh, third and fourth fingers ready, poised, ready to go onto the third fret. There's your hammer on. First fret to second fret. Pinky tucked in. And on the way back down, actually pull that third finger away. From now open G. So we get to that G. Open D. First finger on second fret. Hammer on with your third finger, pinky, back to that third finger, but you pull off to the first finger, so, and then open G. Slowly. And then it's like a bar on the second fret, but third finger on fourth fret, second finger on third fret. slowly First position, third finger on C, then a B chord, then open E, So really slowly, I like to slide up with my third finger there, like an A minor shape on the uh, eighth fret, the first finger, and then down to uh, seventh and eighth. All the while keeping it open E in the bass, and the last one, fourth and fifth frets there again. Plenty of people play that last bit here. And I think that's what he does. There rather than here. So I hear that slide. Make sure it's us to main theme again. 
So for the piano part, which plays along with this bit, I'm going to think about the fifth time around. Uh, just play this chord. It's like a D minor, but on the third fret. And then first string, third string. And you can take it down to that A. It's almost inaudible on the original song. So that's uh, first string, fifth fret, first finger, seventh fret, second string, together, drop it down two frets, and then up to 10 and 12 on the same strings, and then finish with that pinky on the 12th fret of the first string. Again. And then F, so that's the second uh, string, 6th fret, 2nd finger, up 1 fret, up again, up 1 more to ninth, so just that last word again from F, the 7th, to 8th, to ninth. then there's a little half bar on the 8th fret, Fourth finger on 10, third finger on 9, second finger on 8, finish first finger on 7 at speed. Okay, on to the next bit. Um, had a few questions on this, how to do it, and the, um, the first thing is having the second finger onto the E note, 12th fret E string, and you play this, but then we're looking for, if I had 24 frets, then I, I would play it at the 24th fret, but I don't, um, so I have to make it up here, and there's a certain distance along the string from the end of the fingerboard where I can see that harmonic is, now I play that by resting my first finger on the string itself, not pushing down, but just resting it and then plucking it with my third finger here. So I'm keeping this down, and the key is to press this really hard. So I play that first, I come through, and there's my octave E there, my invisible 24th fret. And I pluck it with my third finger and I let it go and hopefully it'll ring out. Now the next one is on the, it's on the tenth fret here, so I have to go from here and then I have to drop it down a little bit here and look for that D here. So from here. This is where I have to really reach up to 17th and 19th, first finger and second finger. So from here again. And really slowly. Down a little bit. Aim for your 17th fret, 19th fret, and then 12th. 15, 14, that's 15 on the 2nd, 1st on 12th fret of the E string, 2nd finger comes over the top on 12th on the D and slides down to the 10th fret. And stay there. Now your 2nd finger just goes onto the 11th fret here and you play the 1st, 2nd and 3rd strings. First string is open. Now that's down to the uh, seventh fret, eighth and ninth, and finish with that ninth fret third. Will that be there? And your third 
third finger switch, fourth finger on tenth, third finger on tenth on the second string, and then up to twelfth on that second. And then open E. again up to 15 first on the 12th now slide up Tenth. that's first finger on the eighth fret third finger on 11th 